Hi guys, thank you guys for clicking on this video and this weekend I will be doing a day in the life. So we are now starting on tonight, so I'm going to be cooking supper, then I'm going to go to bed, wake up and do the whole day. So it'll be, this will be a tiny house day in the life. Let's get started. <coughs> At Target, I got this new like hook set, and I'll show you what's inside of it. So it comes with like this blue flexible um, like cutting board. It comes with um, some clamps for uh, chips and stuff like that. This one has like a magnet on it and stuff like that. It comes with tongs, a spatula, what you just saw me use. Um, a spoon, and then a slotted spoon, kind of like a rubber, uh, I don't know what you call it, but it comes with that, and then a cheese grater, which I'll probably never use, but I guess if I need one, I have one. Then I have all kinds of measuring cups, like a whole set. I have measuring spoons, a whole set. I have like a whisk, ice cream scooper. A can opener, a paring knife, a cork bottle opener with like a knife on it, because I'll be drinking wine at age 13 apparently, and then a pizza cutter, which this will probably come in handy because I love pizza. And so that's all it comes with it, it was like 19 bucks. Another thing I got was a trash can, and so, um... I was gonna get this like the one that was like four bucks and it was just like a little um trash can but then this one's only two ninety nine and it had a closed top and like a little stepper so you step on it and it opens up and there's your trash. So I got those two things at Target and see I was gonna plan on going to like the dollar store and like getting all this stuff but this just seemed way easier. It's probably not the high highest quality um of stuff but this is really all I need for my uh, tiny house and so it all got its own little spot and it'll be put on the shelf so I woke up and went inside had some breakfast that my mom made last night and now I'm just gonna hang out in here So I'm going to make pancakes right now. I was going to make these for breakfast, but I already had breakfast um, that my mom made. So these are going to be um, for lunch. 
and we played some card games um, up in my loft with some of my friends. And yeah, so let's start making pancakes. I have this cooler bag that I put some ice in to keep all my food cold. So we got the milk, we got an egg, olive oil, and that's all we need from the bag. Some stuff in here. Got the mix. And now we just have to all put it together. So where we left off from yesterday was I cooking um, lunch. After that, we uh, came up in my loft where I am right now and played some card games. Then we went to the Y and we played basketball and bracketball. And then we came home around 8.30. I ate some supper and then I came in here and uh, went to bed. So. Um, this is what we got during the night, which I'm not too psyched about because it's been really nice the past few days. So we actually got some snow. So we got snow and we got a lot of rain. Um, when I got picked up by my friend's mom, when we went to get in our car, her like doors were like frozen shut. So it we got a ton of rain. Um... Yeah, I guess this is my like third day sleeping in my house and I'm just getting really comfortable. So I guess I'll start cooking some breakfast. I don't have anything to cook though, so I might grab some stuff to cook. So I brought all the stuff in and for this morning I'm going to be making some French toast. I also packed two extra pieces of bread and brought some peanut butter. So for lunch I can just have a um, peanut butter sandwich. Just something simple because I don't want to cook for lunch. But yeah, I guess I'll start making some French toast. Before I do that, um, in the latest video that is out right now, um, I noticed that two people commented about um, like getting refrigerators. Um, I for right now I'm using just that, that little uh, cooler bag, but um, in the shed actually, that shed right there. Um, in that shed, there's like an electric cooler that I'll probably put underneath um, here and use that. The reason why I can't use like a full-fledged mini fridge is because my power setup is limited to 15 amps. So I have this monitor going, I have my LED lights going, which don't draw anything. But then again, the monitor does take a little electricity. My heater takes electricity. So I have to really watch what I use. Um, this uh, griddle takes electricity. So I mean, I have never um, tripped a breaker yet, but 15 amps, um, most of that would be uh, contributed to just the fridge. So, and I don't really need anything major, um, just something. And plus, um, the reason why I like that bag is because I nor normally, like, just what I did is I prepared everything in my house, brought the um, bread out, and, like, prepared the egg mixture and everything so I prepare everything at home because I don't have a, a sink yet so I can't like wash dishes or anything um so that's what I've been doing for now but it's really easy to use that bag to transport food so that's why I've been using it so maybe in the later future I will get a mini fridge but for right now probably not so I had to run um, let me turn this heater off I had to run into the house to grab some syrup and I thought this was a pretty cool way to keep your uh, food warm while you have to go grab something. Put the plate right on the griddle. The griddle's not on, but just the heat from it keeps the plate warm, which keeps the bread warm. 
everything is melting since it snowed. Everything's melting so quickly because it's actually really warm out. Um, you guys can probably see, probably not. But since my roof like kind of goes like this in the front, the little overhang, um, it's just dripping off there, and it's super muddy right in front of my house. So uh, that kind of sucks, but. At least it's all melting, because like most of the grass over here to this side is already all melted off. So I'm happy about that. And we do have a blacktop driveway. And I'll show you the driveway, but our driveway is super steep and it's pretty crazy. So it's kind of good as a blacktop, because if it's a sunny day when it um, snows, it all melts. Our driveway is completely free of snow, unlike some other people's driveways. Sorry if this video is a little boring, um, I didn't really do much in this video just because I had some friends over and I didn't really have anything to do, but hope you guys enjoyed this video, um, stay tuned for more videos, please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.